the land's available. The hole's already dug. The bowl can fit right down into the space. A site supporters say is fit for the Royals downtown two weeks after the mayor endorsed the Washington Square Park location adjacent to Union Station. It's the downtown Kansas City baseball site with the latest buzz. And tonight only on Fox 4, the designer behind the concept that appears to be at the top of the list is sharing why this site is a no brainer. Fox 4's Malik Jackson live where this new proposed ballpark would be 22nd and Main and 22nd and Grand, right Malik? Yeah, right there, squeeze in between the both of them. I sat down for an extensive conversation with Steve McDowell, who's been working on this conception since January, but him and his team at BNIM took a break as the vote happened in April. But now they're talking again over the last two months, actively working with the mayor's office within the last two weeks, talking with the Royals organization. And today they rolled out a website and new renderings all in hopes of bringing baseball to downtown. A new look at what the now top location for downtown Royals ballpark could look like. A view of the skyline with the iconic Western Auto sign peeking over what would be a new crown vision fit for the Royals. It'll lift all boats. It'll be an incredible uh, revitalization of the whole of Kansas City, as well as the organizations and the businesses that are nearby. Steve McDowell, the principal chairman and CEO of BNIM, has worked months to bring this concept to life. The location would sit not only adjacent to Union Station, but also a streetcar that goes down the center of the city. They estimate 5,000 people would use that for transportation per game. With this location, BNIM says not one current business would be displaced. The question would be, is the space big enough? McDowell says the crossroads location was 584 feet wide, and this location would be 584 feet wide. It's the civic center of Kansas City. It has the scale, the scale of outdoor spaces, in addition that a stadium will fit beautifully in there. It has 19,000 parking spaces within four blocks. It has 12 access points from freeways and other major roadways. And if this is the site of a future stadium, the area is certainly not a stranger to big events. From an NFL draft, the future FIFA World Cup Fan Fest, parades and rallies galore. It's the heart of the city. It's the place that we all come to already. It's the place that we own. And this would also have a pedestrian zone on the other side on Main, sort of like what we see with Boulevardia and Iris Fest. They would shut down the area for games, but they, I mean, we make it work already. They also say this would mirror some of the other iconic stadiums like Chicago with the Cubs or in Boston with the Red Sox, conforming the stadium to already the existing city and not the other way around. So. The saga continues at maybe the future home of the Royals, Washington Square Park. I'm Malik Jackson, Fox 4, working for you.